Welcome. Welcome to Operation Open Roads. I'm Killer Man Time, and I will be your sole proprietor for information and video for this op tonight. That's an odd way of putting commentator, but uh, yes. Anyways, we've got some time to burn here, so I will just get straight into going over commands and team loadouts. Uh, for round one, command is run for the Russian side, Riser. His 2IC being Silas, his four other SLs being Phoenix, Rubba, Krusty Krab, and Rose Dragon 7. And for the US side, we have Command Dorf, with his 2IC being Boogie, his four SLs being Dixfolk 4, The Harve, Block, and Kerr. This could be a very interesting game with those two. Loadout for the US side tonight. We have infantry level, one SL, two FTLs, two ARs, one LAT, and one medic. Platoon level, um, two hats, and, oh yeah, two hats, AT-12s, and two hats, MAAWs, or MAWs. Uh, vehicles, we have two Mat V-50s, six Logies, uh, Looks like 1,000 ammo and 2,000 build each pre-live. In other words, they cannot do anything after live has been called. Uh, FOB and logistics. We're looking at airfield FOB, one mortar and one tow. And various defensive structures, command and SL support missions. Uh, one CAS bombing run. For the Russian side... We are looking at, for infantry squad level, one SL, two FTLs, two ARs, one LAT, one Medic. Vehicles, one BMP-2, one BTR-80, two MTLBs, or NSVTs, two transport trucks, no FOB and logistics. And for command and SL support missions, we have two artillery smoke, uh, smoke six, ra six rounds. Come on, English. Two 82 millimeter mortar barrages and two artillery barrage uh, smoke barrages. With those out of the way, now we can flood around the map and I can answer some questions if y'all got any in this in the uh, chat. Oh, I guess I should also go over this. So, Operation Open Road, as is very very simple op map. Russians come in from the uh, northwestern corner and are attempting to take over the airfield that the U.S. are holding. Uh, U.S. objective is to basically hold off the Russians. Simple. That's not exactly, but if you want to go into detail, you can always take a look at the op doc. And looks like we're about to get the U.S. side briefing. So I'll leave y'all to that. Pee pee poo poo check. What the fuck? Chill check out. the blisters. Right. No more of that. Alright, missing a couple people. All of second squad is here. Quad five's uh, almost here. All right, we'll wait for Revy to get over here and we'll start. All right, good enough. All right, guys, welcome to Wednesday Operation. Stand by. Alright, so yep. thanks for joining us for Wednesday, Operation Open Road. 
Our mission as the U.S. is to defend the Yerivka airfields from Russian attack. Russian forces are known to be a mechanized force with multiple uh, MTLBs, BTRs, BMPs. Um, they have artillery support of some type. Not sure how, how much and what sizes, but we uh, have a cast strike of our own. We have two. We have a pair of MRAPs with 50 cals. Basically, our whole mission defending the radio, defending the airfield. The radio is housed inside the tent there, right behind you. Um, that's really it. Second command's boogie. And then whoever decides to take charge after that is, well, who's in charge? Um, your area of defense is Boogie in the northwest corner, and squad leaders, please mark your locations. Boogie in the northwest corner, Dick's Folk in the northeast corner, uh, around the buildings here. Kerr is going to be on the southeast part of the uh, buildings, just south of Dick's Folk, with an MRAP himself. Um, the sniper mark is going to be is going to be Block Squad watching west, and then down in the south on both south corners will be. Hard Squad, watching our south, east, and southwest. And he will also have an MRAP. Uh, let's uh, go ahead, save this questions for your squad leaders. Let's go ahead and start building shit. And we are live. And it's just up to waiting for the Russian forces to uh, push in, choose a side, and... Find out how this the dominoes fall. If anyone's got a couple guys that can still spare for the HQ area, let me know because I can use them. Hard chips, whichever you want to go with. I like dominoes. Still plenty to build over here. Except for you in the south, you stay in the south. Some mortar pits set up over here. No, not mortar pits. No, I mean technically yes, those Current would be where you would put them, I guess. Warehouse. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'll get a couple guys with you in a second. That's what I was about to say. <laughs> well, then. Uh, no, you go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Looks like the Russian force is moving out. They have split up from one of their vehicles. Possibly going to be coming in from the west side. Remember, we have Looks a like they've got two trans trucks coming towards the northern side. Won't know anything official until they get here, but that's my prediction. Chicken, what are you doing, bro? Any more here? Um, yeah, let me put it yeah, down. Yeah, inside, get inside, get inside, get inside. He needs help inside. Inside? Yes, in inside, inside the warehouse. Oh, inside. Another oh, it's a building. Got to get all that building they can get in before the Russians get here. Don't want to be caught with your pants down. Copy. Oh, we got all the way over here. Ah, uh, okay, we've got some forces at the far end. Really defend. And Harv loaning it over here. Southwest 
to west if you want to look northwest to north, maybe. Uh, I need one person in that yeah. buddy team. You want to go? All right. Let's not, let's not negate our whole northeast defense there, Dick's folk. I'm moving, guys. I was just digging. I'm moving, guys, back up there. We should have at most only three people building any time. That's any squad. Sorry, I started focusing in on the uh, game. Uh, yeah, to answer that, I will not be going in first-person POV based uh, into this op. I am the commentator, so I'll be floating around and hopefully getting y'all some views of action and things that are happening above the normal soldier's head. Northwest has some tree lines. I'm not going to be able to see anything until they're about 200 meters away from me, so be advised on that. Yeah, that's usually why your position gets rolled up. Gonna be fun, mate. Just, if, when you start getting fucking mess with, just make sure you uh, roll back through the trenches. This is still first thing. half. You're not late. Contingency plans have been in place. Heck, we just We're started, too. Here. Have crescents, normal, bar, ladder. That's it. Oh, that's weird. I really thought you had pillbox. That's odd. All right. If only pub matches were this organized. They can be. <laughs> Notice that most of the whole ops squads and pub matches tend to always have the highest score. You don't want my answer on that one, miss. Pineapple and pizza, me, nah. Mm -mm. That's just too sweet. Expecting either a major push from the uh, southwest or the east. Give me fucking arms for where squad one is. As the Copy. Whatever you hear, drop fucking coordinates quick so I can get mortars out on them. Yeah, they have to push past one without them being. Safer. And be careful, they do have a fucking BMP. Mm -hmm. They will have a BMP, so that's a fucking splash damage right there, so mm -hmm. try to stay clear of that. Uh, I, don't uh, like I think I his prediction is going to be off just slightly. Uh, looks like we've got a pretty even spread, well, even as it can be, like of uh, Russian forces far. coming we'll mainly from the northwest, north, and whatever the rest of the crew decides to do with the uh, armor going east. Just make sure... Some I want this to have cover. Uh, no. The other camera. So, if you see... Let's see if I can find them. That right there. That is our one of our event admins. There's one per team. Uh, they make sure that everyone is playing fairly. And they are abiding by uh, op rules. They have nothing to do with the media. Uh, Russian, they do have artillery. They have s two artillery smoke rounds, uh, six round each, and two 82 millimeter mortar barrages, and two artillery smoke barrages. 
That is the Russian artillery loadout. Once they use all that up, they got nothing. Also, remember, we have an A-10 strike, so if you got a good fucking spot for an A-10, let me know. Uh, yep, and that is the U.S. side. Oh, this is a sexy line you guys have. What kind of U-shape is this? God, I hope they come from the West. I guess That's I should fucking... repost. That'd be so nice. For those of you wondering what's in the op, what uh, loadouts are available, uh, in that is the op doc, and it gives you basically all the information you could possibly want to know. We're probably falling back. It's a placeable yeah. item in your inventory. Um, uh, such there's, as there's uh, weird explosions in the north east. Not sure how relevant so that is. You have to do rally up to some stuff. Stab perm, so you should be able to do that there. Pretty sure it's just a clamp crew. Sod copy. Everything good, though, bro? All good? Family side? Oh, yeah, man. For sure. Excellent. Glad to hear. Glad to have you back, man. It's been a long Glad time. I know, dude. You know you're doing my sod, right? And it looks like the Northwestern vehicle has finally dropped its, uh... Payload of soldiers. And the east is northeast is still holding. Not sure what they're gonna do. That was two years ago, dude. Dude, yeah, it's been years that we've all been gaming together. It's it's been a minute. Harv? Yes, sir. I hope Tinkerbell knows to keep his head his head down. Yep, I've already told him that if he gets shot at, he's alone up there. <laughs> wait, wait, where is Tinkerbell at? Everyone's going to be angry at you and shoot back at you. Ah. Oh, there he is. Let's turn that engine off. Ah, the death box, as I like to call it. Third squad, the second squad. I'm getting call outs that you're. In a they're getting close. Uh, India 599. Nine. Looks like they're getting positioned before they start pushing. Is that possible Hi. contact at Hotel India 599? Yeah, this is a one life, so if they go down, they're down. They don't come back until round two. Say again, that grid? He's new. He's He confirms that there's somebody ducking in and out of the gullies west, southwest of three right now. Boombox or something. I don't very have eyes on right now. I'm moving. Coffee. I wish. Yeah, it's very possible right now. It's hard to see my direct uh, southwest. Uh, no. There is no functionality for us to switch between squad uh, radios, so it's I'm limited to only being able to capture local chats and um, command chat. You're saying it was a Hotel 15, right? I know I won it a couple times in a row. I think, I don't know, the last one I... I think Alpha Guido beat me by one vote. But I hadn't played That's in a bullshit. long time at that point. That's bullshit. <laughs> I'm good to have you back, man. I'm gonna go rotate around and make sure these Yahoos are good. Hell yeah, dude. Looking forward to this round. It's gonna be fun. Hell yeah. Yeah, the last call out is approximate location. India 15 to 4 2 along that hill with the tree line. That might have really been close. Me. Yeah, there's no way that they'd be in Hotel 
or an I-15 because um, I see them. That's a big. That's a big open hill in front of me here, to my west. So he might Solid have been seeing me. Do you have players out there right now? Negative. And just to confirm, nobody's outside the wire right now. Good oh yeah, my guys are outside the wire right now. All good. Just uh, listening. I got them spread out, so... No car Give me if you have any questions later, okay? But there's nobody in this yeah. gully in front of me here to the west. Thanks, sir. If it's taking them this long, it is possible they're gonna do it for a a deep southwest attack or a uh, east attack. A southwest attack or a deep southeast attack. I'm being a There's the eastern flank right there. Oh, I was about to say, why are you asking on my guy? Possible audio contact west of the MRAP, on my MRAP. Copy. I'm trying to confirm real quick, but yeah. The ditch from the. No, not really. Oh. I can see parts of it. Do you have a guy on that? Because I'm worried about that. Um, I'm the really only one that can s kind of see it. Um. Yeah, we had a shot. I don't know where. North. North or maybe south. Indy. That was an enemy that Indy. It sounds south, like. Yeah, meet up with Nos. I'm pretty sure it was an ND towards okay. north. Um, it around. was. It sounded like. It you got my hat. Totally sounded like I-13 oh, okay. somewhere. I'm getting called out. Uh, movement straight north of uh, Dixfold. I'm gonna go with a snapple. Oh. Straight north. All right, take your spots. You have a. Yeah, definitely def def audio. I have, yeah, I have audio on tracks, north, northeast. Copy. Yeah, confirm that audio that I heard to the west. What are we engaging? Uh, command, uh, squad five, we are engaging, uh, light infantry a good 150 meters away on the hills. They have not crossed the road yet. You have a grid? I can't get the exact grid. Somewhere in a J13 or um, Kilo 13. Copy. I'm gonna hit Kilo 1371. All right, we have contacts northwest 300 meters. Contacts on the north. Do you have an accurate grid ish? I1356 light. What? Say again, Boogie. We have uh, north and lower, north and lower, Juliet 1254, contacts. Copy. Northwest and north, we're gonna start lining them up here. Never. Everyone's free to engage. Oh, 
Looks like the U.S. already using that art, those mortar pits. Russians getting lined up before they start pushing in. Thank you. I'm not going to be able to push up to hit that arm. Looks like the U.S. forces falling back to, on their uh, western side. From the northeast. We side. just got overshot. Hey, I got, I got PRP northeast. If you've got a good fucking marker for it, put it down. Yup, I'll try. Hold on. Chicken's dead. Fuck. Tag on. That came from the northeast east. Yeah, my guys are being, mo are being mortared right now. Copy three. Squad five, no uh, enemy contact. Northwest right now, we're straight north. Roger. From my position. No I Russian forces on the point angle. just yet. Right oh, now. it looks like we got the western side pushing in. Copy command. I pulled my guys back to a secondary location. Uh, we're getting pretty wrecked up in the northwest. Copy. If they take up your old positions, let me know. I'll hit them. Looks like an artillery barrage just went down on the southeastern corner of the airfield. And Russians have successfully made it within the airfield. Or at least have gotten into the trenches on the exterior. Oh, I hear a BTR real close. Man, there was smoke more's right in our position. Can you, uh, more? Ooh, down goes. Down. Is that a Who BTR got down? that? BTR's down. Good shit. Stand by, mortars. I got a mortar. Not sure who took right that now. shot. But good stuff there, and it's gonna weaken the uh, Russian forces just a bit. But that's only one vehicle out of what four? Bogey, are these mortars? Got some Russian forces pulling across the eastern field here. Big folk, how close are they to your north? They are directly across the road. They're throwing us small arms smoke grenades out. They're about across. Copy. 
This is X, X talking over east one. and southeast. We still have BMP over here. Copy. Looks like the Russian forces are slowly making their way through the trench line. Be advised, we have enemy contact to the west of my location in our trench uh, positions. We're taking, we're Eight taking one. Yeah, just bunker down. Goes one of the vehicles. I think that was one of our M wraps. Command frames are taking over, a tank uh, here. Uh, we lost, took casualties to their mortar barrage. Yeah. We have with so. enemies in with grenade range of north. Nade. Yeah. Oh, nade on the Bring it. Just everyone oh, fall shit. back tighter and tighter. Torp B I got a squad. At least a squad inside of the brick containers. They keep them with us. Yeah. Or BMP. Looks like we got the uh, Russians dropping one of their smoke barrages down. Copy. Two, there's contact in those trenches. You're pushing up. And here come the Russian forces pushing into the upper compound. Context to our west and north. Uh, update on what you want us to do. Just do what you can to survive. I might go down Five trying to get on this tow. Five is smoked out on the northeast. With them, will be rolling in on the northeast. TLB was hit. I'm gonna go down. I'm gonna go down. I'm gonna go down. But I'm gonna take this fucker with me. Pushing it on the north, north side. I'm chilled down. Yep, I'm hit though. They're getting close on my north, guys. I need you to pull it back in one, one, come back to Bob. One's coming back to Bob. You got Charlie team heading up Everyone there. We've got a collapse back. order. The tow is gone. The tow is gone. More smoke coming in. That should be the second barrage. Yeah, no, that's the sixth round. That was friendly fire right there. Never good. Be advised, we have enemy on our paws. Ooh, Soldier Wolfie enemy. goes down to a nade. They're Not sure right he'd buy. Yeah, I'm aware. So I need everyone falling back. Remember, we still have an airstrike, so call in where the vehicles are, and I can call in an airstrike or a lot of infantry. We still got a. Ooh. U.S. force is still putting up a good defense here, but they are getting shredded. J-13-2-7. 
just taking out yourself. all the same Either bags. Like a request tactical marker down. Pardon? There's a T-wheel. Stand by. One to command. Send it. We have a uh, enemy, heavy enemy location on our uh, trenches. Firm. Three. Are you able to get back? Yeah, this us? way. All that is yeah, holding the Russians right now, on this side is silent the south here. and Nas, yeah. keeping them from pushing so on. I'll worry about the south later. I gotta just get the ship focused on the north. Copy. That yeah, alone's copy. pretty cool. I'm pretty sure they rule right the fuck over us. Uh, request. To your north. No. That's not a request. That's not a marker I can use. Sounds good. Alright. Never mind. Request tactical <laughs> support from commander. It's at the bottom of your T wheel. And then you have to confirm it. Yeah, it doesn't do much good. More if smoke I'm in the coming in. Right now. Uh, I got one down in J13. He's somewhere around there, but it's not an accurate mark. Could we'll be looking at the next push from the Russians right here. How should I right face the west or what? Uh, let me let me try and get a new mark now. I think they're directly east of us. Smoke's on the pods, so careful guys. Whatever, I'm just putting one down. If it's good, it's good. If it's not, it's not. Sure. Sorry, Dorf. That was, uh, the callouts were from my Charlie team that were up to the north. I didn't have eyes on. Hey, firm. Doesn't sound like my run's gonna be good. Two nice. more outside. I, got, I still got that audio on the track, so I'm gonna try to get my guys to take it out here. Yeah, they're one of Bert. Thank you, please. If we can take out the BMP, we might have a chance. Does not look like it made any contact. I have audio on the BMP to the south. Revy almost got the pull on him. Revy sounds like he's a bit. They're on the hab. He made Copy. contact when he's up. Yeah. Yeah, they're right on the hab, I hear him. Walking through the bushes now. Killed one. Nice. There's another one pushing me. Kill one coming into the trench. They're coming into the tent. Ashford, uh, I might go down here. Down goes command for the down. US side. We're gonna fucking own this. Two has a looking in there. Looks like Dorf is down. It's just me and one other guy right now in the trenches. Copy, we're getting pushed hard from the south here. The BMP's to the south. We got one hit on it. Try to defend as much as possible. We're gonna try to get to you, but it's probably gonna be impossible. Yep, see you on the other side. Yep. Hey, they're right up on us. Look, 330. He's over this way. Check fire mode. I would go automatic. Uh, sadly, uh, Dan, there is no way to turn off the spectator cam.
uh, icons. They are packaged in with everyone else's name and icons. Uh, it's been a constant request to OWI to give us the function to turn off at least just the spectator cam icons and name tags. Till that is done, though, we are stuck with the gnats, as uh, we have come to like to call them. And it looks like whatever's left of the U.S. forces must now attempt to retake U.S. FOB. All right, guys, we're going to try to get into these buildings. That's the plan. We're going to come in the way they, they did. Call them all for it. Trench right over here. Come on. Call smoke if you need it. Negative. They'll just give us give our position away. Yeah. Watch it, watch it, watch it. Yeah, and you want to know how annoying they are? See, that's the reason why I haven't opened up the map in a while now. I took All right. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Can be out in the open for a little bit. I go across, Ross. No. Oh, I really don't want to go that way. We've got at least two on these fob defenses to our southwest. I think we have the drop yeah, on don't, them. Don't don't meta game. Let's look at that BMP we got to deal with too. All right, here's the plan. We're going to jump in this trench, and we're going to move in close, uh, slowly and silently. Sounds good. Ready? I'm ready. I need, I need one of you to go first. I'll go point. Go ahead, Sully. So we're taking these trenches just straight south? Yep. Straight west here. All right, crossing. Last man, Harv. Was last man, Harv, oh. taken down by a lat. That oh just, God. that's horrible. All right. That is, wait. Yep, that's GG for round one. We'll be right back for round two shortly. Big beat on me, had people who were mad. Yeah, it looks like we yeah, got... Quick uh, yeah. brief while you get the vehicle sorted. Brief? Yeah, you should be all set. Alright. Okay, you're talking about the, the war against Prayers. the Zulus. Alright, just need to go ahead and get started with the platoon brief. Go ahead and get any cons. Alright, so well done, all cons. everybody. That was a fantastic job assaulting that airfield. It's pretty textbook, and I love seeing it from behind. I'm sure you guys had a lot of fun actually uh, doing it. Once again, proud of you guys, did well. But now to move on to this round. So pretty much the reverse of the last one. This time we're actually going to be trying to hold on to this last line of defense in the Eurovka area. Uh, our airfield out west. We've got reports of Russian forces kind of mobilizing and taking other key terrain in the area. So uh, it's very important that we hold this airfield to keep this kind of pathway open. Uh, to do this, go ahead and open up your maps. We will be setting up near that FOB mark on the southwest end of the airfield by the hangars. That'll be our FOB proper. That is our last line of defense. If you lose comms, you need to try to fall back or get eyes in the area to assist. Holding FOB proper will be Silas's squad, setting up a ATGM position, as well as handling the MRAPs to try to get them in hold down positions and support everybody else. Out east will be Rose, near the helmet mark. 
he'll be responsible for sending out a ATGM, or not ATGM, a uh, hat killer team to try to hit any vehicles that try to hit us from the eastern approach. His goal is just generally being a pain in the ass on the eastern side of the compound. Watching his flank down south will be Phoenix, who will be doing similar with his hat team out in those little ridges. Once again, trying to uh, make sure we have little OPs out there so we can see where they're coming from and adjust as needed. Further out west will be Rubba, near the marksman mark, setting up kind of watching the west northwestern approach towards our fob. And then further up north will be, I believe it was Krusty, yep, Krusty, who will be setting up OPs in those trenches further north to try to get eyes on where the Russians are coming from. Those of you who are up north, I already told him, but just to reiterate, your job is a bit risky and your job is not to hold those positions. Your job is to get eyes on and fall back as able. You'll have multiple squads back at the FOB proper to assist you in that endeavor. Now squad leads, let's get mounted up, break our guys out. And we've gone live. I guess I should have flowed over, but it doesn't really matter. We're going to see what the Russians do once they get past the highway. And I don't really want to take any guesses, but I'm going to say Phoenix, I need west to and north. CJ that's uh, that's their attack points. I could be wrong because it looks like they're already going uh, east. Julia, 15, what? There's a gap in the fence to our east, right here. So can we push past airfield during live? Alright, sounds like three men should be taking care of that. Take it, three. Polkron is not gonna make it. Are we able to put out past the zone of airfield after live, yes? Yes. It's gonna be a lot Alright, awesome. We're just looking for OPs, nothing crazy. What the hell? No. Oh, interesting. Oh no. <laughs> As a reminder, if you have a lot of vehicle assets, try to use Hesco where possible. I know it's expensive, but it'll keep you alive. Go ahead, too. Um, a firm. You don't need to plug this gap. To retreat back through. But uh, you were screening. Roger that. Yeah, let's make sure we're reserving 600 in case we need to relocate the tow. I thought the tow was non movable. It is movable, but not if it's destroyed. We have to dig it down ourselves and move it. How oh, copy. So basically, if they shoot it, it's gone. Yeah, I just want to check the uh, op doc to make sure that was correct, but it is. If the tow is destroyed, uh, unable to be dug back up, it is uh, not movable. But if it hasn't been destroyed yet, then yes. And we're fighting once more with the op doc, just in case anyone in here wants to take a look at it. All right, the Alamo is pretty secure with Hesco's. Got any water? Have that one. Plenty. And it looks like my prediction was completely off the mark, and we might be looking at north and east push uh, from the Russians. So that's just a heads up. Uh, my field of uh, attack. Alright, we're down to 700 builds. Be sparing. Make sure we stay above 600. They're coming from the north or the east. As a reminder, we are rated a close air support asset. So you know. 
Yeah, I just forgot about the east side completely. So if you see a BMP or something else that looks tasty, be sure to mark that. Let me know. Otherwise, at this point, we should be heading to our defensive positions and getting ready for a contact. Blind spot's not the only thing he's got to deal with. Copy that command. If BLT um, is spotted, we will consume it. If vehicles don't come in that direction, <laughs> you are pretty much screwed. BLTs. I mean, that's a great place. Good positioning for it, but, um... Kind of locked yourself down to looking at the southern direction. It looks like we got some Russians moving off to the western direction this time, too, so I might not be too far off the money. They may be doing the exact same thing that the uh, first round did, which was uh, send a couple down west, send, I think, one or two down, uh, down the northern side, and then everyone else was on the east, northeast, east. Which isn't going to mean too much because the U.S. is set up on the opposite end of the airfield this time, so I guess pushing into the trenches could be their best bet here for the uh, foot soldiers, uh, keeping their heads down and moving along the trenches. All they'd have to worry about is anyone up in that uh, tower there. But uh, vehicle-wise, I think they would have a better chance of pushing vehicles down the western side and pushing them up maybe the eastern side yep they know which hangar right where to go <laughs> um it depends on the terminology you want to use but this is basically admin cam um it is what our event admins use to fly around and make sure everyone's playing by the rules. Um, uh, it's terrible line of sight over just here. a glorified uh, spectator cam, really. The, uh, terrain slopes glorified, I want to say, uh, under uh, or lacking in functionality. Coast, yes. They could easily get I would love it if it had smooth movement instead of sand, normal aiming. Understood. Just to smooth it out if I'm looking at something good. instead of making really hard jerk motions. Um, I keep all this kind of tight, though, and they, also they the ability to remove mats. Checking where the Russians are right now. It looks like majority are headed east. Okay, so we've got one group coming here from the west, and the rest are headed on to the east side. This could be interesting. Very, very interesting. Which is not going to be an effective use of this force that was just sent out to the western side. I don't know. Looks like we've got squad three over here. Looking down into the valley. Yeah, I got Possible audio on vehicle, wait one. Yeah, I'm using it because I don't have a binox, so it's got some level of magnification. <laughs> uh, like do you know how far that tree line is? Do you, do you want an estimate for the tree line? I guess the tree uh, line is about, about five, meters. Yeah, five to seven. So I think it's about. Definitely more spread out than round one U.S. side. I don't know how it's going to play into their favor, though. Four, two. 
Go ahead. Do you have a direction or possible distance on what you're hearing? Uh, north east further from my team leader. I'm going to cover use their mobility and dance around. Copy. Them. Yeah, probably. We're going to get the holy crap there to um, come back. It's usually how it works for any uh any uh people that are far out from the fob position. Usually are the ones who have to come running back to the fob because they've completely flanked them. Ford, did you confirm that audio to your north? Negative, not confirmed. Nothing more for my team leader. Yeah. yeah, it looks like we've got Russians just hopped out of their first logistics or uh, troop transport. Squad six and five. No updates on noise, we'll disregard it this time. The Navy doing what we did, dismounting a knife. Just keep peeled for infantry as well. Oh, you mean uh, along the lines yeah, of Novo, if so you're dead, you can still hear your surroundings or whatnot and Novo still communicate with your squad? Um, Copy that for Oh, really? That comes down to, yeah. I think there's um, a certain period before the event admin will float up to your dead body and uh, tell you that you need to, uh, what's it called, surrender and leave your squad Heard and that. enter spectator. That is how we keep uh, people from communicating within their squads once they're dead. Got on this map. Not entirely no, sure what that explosion, explosion audio was, okay. but it sounded like it was a tracked Vic blown up. Uh, I believe the, uh, the explosion audio was times. our main. I think the vehicle yep. main pop after time. Yeah, they do. Yep, they do. Long distance though. Yeah. Yeah. Almost. It's gonna keep constantly on the steam. I've never heard an explosion that wasn't an actual explosion. <laughs> Uh, Lima 13, we had visual on people binoing up on that hill. Lima 13, copy. Lock, lock on a uh, line of sight, Scottish. Pick a spot. Vulture, when you took basic, what was the spacing you're supposed to have in between two people? Remind me. 15 meters. Are we 15 away from Nightmare? Three rounds out of Times one. Right, 1276 approximate. Times one. Got it. Command, eyes on the contact at Lima 13. Uh. Sounds like we've got. Oh, okay, I remember what that is. Um. Either misfires or we did have back when I first started playing vehicles in the main yeah, would actually 13, um they blow up. Thirteen one. And it does look like someone took some damage over on the Russian side where I'm hearing those explosions from. We'll have to come back real quick. Cause it looks like squad four is about to come in contact with US squad four. But um, as far as I can tell, yeah, they aren't explosions explosions. They're more either ambience or vehicles Three somewhere out in the Three map that have just decided they don't want to be alive anymore command. and have gone boom. Or command three. Command three. My Bravo fire team is calling out enemy contacts in Lima 15-9. In the Lima 15-9, copy. Make that. Actually, wait. 
Nope, I could be wrong. I think that might be our mortar squad. If I knew where they were. Yep, here he is. Those are what those explosions are you hear off in the distance. Three rounds out towards the fishbowl. Copy, uh, uh, Command 3, the contacts are appearing to go west along the trench up to my present position. Copy. Gonna saturate it. One's got no visual on him. Contacts northeast or er, northwest. Possible contacts northwest. India three one three five nine. India one three five nine. Command three. Go ahead. Those are fairly good mortars. Enemy vehicle present in Mike fourteen four fourteen six. Also, I see one enemy squad heading west towards squad four. Cabinet. Four, can you start pulling it in? Go ahead. I also have contact in Kilo 14, keypad 2. Rose, could you ID Dude, that vehicle right now? Kind of off on that call out, that would be Lima, keypad 1. More on it, but he's close. Command five. Go ahead, five. My guys are positioned out here in the southwest to react quickly if we're needed in the eastern northeast. Um, we're happy to hold. Uh, however, if we need to, we can set up south Phoenix. three. Yeah, go ahead, start doing it. K13, three, enemies moving east to west on intersection. I have engines directly to the west Copy. of my location. Alright, get out of there. I'm gonna start bombing the corner of that compound. Command, I got two enemy vehicles entering the uh, fishbowl at uh, Lima 14-3. Copy. Awesome, my Bravo Sorry, fire is keeping the nice contact close. Based on the data we're getting, I don't think they're going to push more than a single squad flanking out to our west. I'm going to leave a fire team out here on the west just to keep a listening post and send our supports to the east. Understood, too. Command. Mm, bad call out for those mortars. I got to be Kilo 15-7 in the field. Copy, Kilo 15-7 in the field. Yeah, BMB's taking two hits. BMP destroyed. Good shit. Well done, Thomas. That's gonna be a big fucking help. <laughs> it's a bit of an understatement. Yeah, good kill on the BMP. The mortars hang for that field to assist your units. We got plenty of ammo. Just let me. Kilo 15. Oh, hold on. Last round's out. Yeah, we're hitting another close, about 150 meters. Command five. You want five on point on the eastern side, and you want us reinforcing threes eastern open. Can I go ahead and reinforce three? I'll block down that road. Those guys need to fall back, which they're helping. Understood. Command recommend shift fire to Kilo 14 4. Enemy contact in the field. 
They're preparing to the cross the road at the north end of the compound. Copy that. Yeah, it looks like the western forces for the Russians are backing off. Much further north. Much further north. Copy that. Not sure if the Russians realize or not that there is nothing on this end of the compound. Maybe just using it for the ability to get in the trench line. coming in on that corner. Come in, two. Got two. Down goes Dick's folk. Two is pulling back all forces inside an uh, airfield of proper. We don't have decent eyes out there. There's no practical Copy. reason. Copy. Just try to lock down that entrance. I think we're good to keep the tow where it currently is, so if you need to build the fences near that western side, you're good too. Just tuck it in and cover our west. Zero thirty seven up the hill. All right, zero thirty seven, that first line of bushes. Um, zero thirty eight. I don't oh, think shit. I can help you on that one. Have you tried right. restarting your uh, stream? Oh, wait, he can't hear me. Damn it. So they are north of you right now. That is correct. I have eyes on enemy contact north. It does not look like anyone is paying attention to this force on the western side. They knew they were here, but they, uh... Might gun it right up to the fence line. I know there's a break somewhere over here. Right here. Still waiting on the Russian forces to get within close quarters at this point, and we're still getting long distance trades. And it looks like the Russians are in the trench line now. And speaking of Russians. TR West. Are you on BTR 
west. And it looks like the west side has been called. Hands are heading out for Enemies are mortaring the southeastern position. Five, get out of there. Heard, breaking. And we've got a strategically placed artillery round drop right Command. there on the corner. That's gonna hurt us there. Down goes Rose Dragon 7. And that should be the second artillery barrage being dropped over here. Just trying to lock it down though. No, that might have been the US using our mortars now I think about it. Phoenix's group has here. taken out Where the, the, the Make sure you guys are in hard cover. Russian vehicle over here. Heard. Command two. For some reason, we've got Go Bogey and Nas hiding so in the back of one of the empty hangers. Looks like we got one, maybe two of the uh, Russian smoke barrages have gone down. Looks like the rest of the Russians are going to try and force their way into the hangar area. Up in the east, 
by the fishbowl. Just be aware that those are still out there. Two MTLBs east. Copy. Three, 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 you have enemy infantry directly to your north, within a hundred. Command, if we have friendly mortar shots, please hold straight to the tower. I don't think there was anything still up there. I got contact, so 43 north. That's how they're not Oof. Breaching the fence line here. If only these two crawling around in the middle of the field. What are y'all doing out here? Close, close, close. Fulcrum, do you still have enemy infantry contact west? I'm trying to find out right now. Alright, thank you. Ah, yes. Uh, kill count. So we've got US sides, 11 kills. Poor Lego just went down. Um, and for the Russian side, we've got 21 kills. That leaves about 30-ish uh, U.S. forces left. 30 to 20. Enemy smoke coming in. Oh, those are mortars actually overhead cover. Mortar barrage is about... security team out to the southwest. I could pull all of them east if you want me hunting down that armor. So I actually like you locking down that entrance. Just AT if you need it. I would just have the one AT man. I don't want to send him on his own. Strike inbound on one of the MTLBs. Let's hope it stays there. I believe it. Well, that's not good for you, Sasa. Overhead cover now. Remember that smoke. Watch for infantry assault. Smoke six round drop straight on the uh, command for the US side. Not really much can be done with that, except for the Russian forces pushing up both the trench line and the exterior of the fence line over here. I want you starting to ramp around the north on the west side for the get up item. And got another A-10. Came in and knocked out nothing, really. It looks like they were trying to hit the vehicle coming up through the, the uh, airfield here, but uh, missed. Update on kill count, we've got 16 kills on the U.S. side and 27 kills for the Russian side. Enemy MTLB is entering northeast side of airfield. U.S. forces are dwindling at this point. We'll pin the fucking metal walls, be careful. Takes 
Contact's care Western of the uh, last the Western pushing Russian soldier. And now we've got Phoenix setting up in the forest line, taking care of whoever's coming out of the exterior. Russians are not doing a fantastic job of uh, pushing this fob. I don't know what this... But I'd be opening up. I'd just make sure they have their heads down. Got some cover fire and allow your uh, forces to push in. That's me. Don't know what's going through their heads right now. Negative, they flipped mortars. Heard a lot of enemy infantry in the western trenches pushing south, according to my team. Copy. Advise getting some ice straight north. Russian forces getting set up once more right here at the end of the trench line. Contact is trying to push into the north, good eyes. Enemy MTL being destroyed. Good job, Phoenix. Got more smoke inbound, they're about to push us. Start Contact watching this. Let's go over here right and here. see what these two are doing. Oh, that's a deadly team if I've ever seen one. Nightmare is not one to play with, especially if he gets behind you. Yeah, they had enemy infantry in that compound east. Okay, but we have friendlies near there. I don't think we have command comms with them though. Five, your Eastern Buddy Team has contacts in the cargo container area to your northeast. Still have infantry trickling in from the north. Pretty slow at this point. Still have one times enemy MTLB in the northeast. Copy that. Major hats are last major asset outside the wire to deal with that. Keep them alive. Command enemy enemy infantry underneath the ATC northeast of you. Understood. They're popping smoke and beginning to push. More smokes inbound, got at least three of them about to push into the north. Still stacked up by that building. Recall that, Phoenix. The Russian forces pushing into the front line of the uh, hangars. Contacts are starting to breach the northern hangar. Beware. The Razor is taking an <laughs> interesting position right there in the open. Or you might have guys that are about to start knocking on your door. Be ready. Copy that. Yeah. We have multiple contacts east of the right Close side. Hangar, north of the equipment. Understood. Update on uh, kill counts. We've got 28 kills on the U.S. side, 29 on the Russian. They're pretty even now. Went 
down. Heard, harden up. 20 squads still have ET assets. Still have one times enemy MTLB to the east. Four, four is out of AT. Got it. Five just lost our last LAT as well. Five, they're directly south of you. We also have contact with our team, I think. Understood. Those might be friendly. Those might be friendly. We have blueberries there. Roger. Well, the blueberries are behind them. Behind them. They're trying to storm that thing. We just gotta hold still. We gotta hold tight. Hold tight. I just killed one. We can kill the infantry. Copy. If we can kill the infantry, we can win. Roger. I'll have to conserve shots. Got two mags left on AR. Half bluff. Okay, here's the situation. Everyone in the sound of my voice, Alamo, Alamo. We have to kill infantry. We still have friendly forces maneuvering outside, but we have to stay alive. They're running around the back. Four right in front of me. Copy. I hear them. I've got right, you've got left. Copy. Got gotcha. you. On the right side. I go down. It's like, I don't know. Stand up or something. Four, you have contact southwest, south of the southern hangar. Yeah, yeah, we know, we know. We're getting ready. Our boys over there saving us. Still hear movement behind our behind our hangar here. Copy. Yep. Yeah. This is four. We've got movement the, behind uh, our hangar. On the left side. Sounds like Copy it. Copy that. I've still got right. We blocked this other hangar. Four. Is that contact west of your hangar? No, we're in the middle hangar. We're in the middle north. But we have no, I understand this. Where's... Alright. Five, they might be behind the hangars. Sounds like here they come in. Five coming in. Five's coming in from the north. I've told them that they might be behind us. We just placed something down. Was that? Was that? That that was the that enemy. Was Sounds like the enemy. They just put down an ammo bag. Or is that an explosive? We'll find out. Okay. Got one. Got one. Got eight. I still heard, I think that sound came from the south side. I'm walking right. to breach the hangar. We don't know how many are left. Understood. It's likely just the enemies in that MTLB. Which, uh, don't count on that. Possibly.
Just do, yeah, just run. That's a smart move. Got one. Gain control over the farm position. Yeah, he's being a little fucking bitch. God damn it. Yep, still somebody on the gun too. I'll put a smoke on it. Maybe we can fucking do something. I don't know. It might put us away though. forces must attempt to retake the FOB location. Frost not doing such a great job at uh, making sure no one gets up and close. Oh, that is dirty. I 
it's sweet, no doubt, but like the smokes aren't gonna last, but you guys kinda gotta go. Duke almost having a uh, friendly fire moment there on Nightmare. More smokes out on the enemy vehicle. Smokes are great, they just don't stop it. And down goes Duke. I'm gonna wait till these fucking smokes can be clear. <laughs> I don't care. I don't care anymore. I get two shits. He smokes and clear, and then I can shoot some fucking people. Or get shot. No, not team kill. Or this turret can turn around and fucking shoot me. One of the two. Let's go. I'm not fucking this. I'm done. That's funny. Look somewhere else. Stop being a bitch. <laughs> Whatever, I'll run out of here. <laughs> and that's GG for round two. <laughs> All right.